Hello everyone, this is Juan from KenHub and welcome to another anatomy tutorial where today we're going to be talking about the muscles of the orbit. On this tutorial, we will take a look at the muscles and related structures of the orbit. We will be focusing on the muscles that control the movement of the eye and their related structures. Now, without keeping you waiting, I'm going to show you the first structure that we're going to be talking about, this muscle that you see here highlighted in green, which is known as the levator palpebrae superioris. And keep in mind that we're looking at the muscle from a lateral left view. Now, as the name suggests, this is the muscle responsible for lifting of the upper eyelid. So the contraction of this muscle elevates your eyelids. And in terms of innervation, the muscle is going to be innervated by the oculomotor nerve or cranial nerve number three. And if you take a closer look here at this, this image, you notice that this muscle originates from the lesser wing of the sphenoid bone. And I can also show you here this image that we can look at the muscle from a superior view if we were to section the skull and expose the orbit from a superior view, then this is how the levator palpebrae superioris would be seen. And you can also see here the lesser wing of the sphenoid section and the origin point for this muscle. We're now ready to move on to the next muscle that you see here highlighted in green laterally. This is the superior oblique muscle, which is innervated by the trochlear nerve or cranial nerve number four. It has its origin from the body of the sphenoid bone, as you can also see here and passes through the trochlear, inserting in the posterior lateral part of the sclera. Now the contraction of this muscle abducts, depresses, and medially rotates the eye. And you can see also here an image from a superior view of the superior oblique muscle. Next muscle that we're going to be talking about is this one seen also highlighted. This is known as the superior rectus muscle. And the superior rectus muscle elevates and medially rotates the eye. It is innervated by the oculomotor nerve or cranial nerve number three. It has its origin from the common tendinous ring and it inserts on the sclera of the eye as you can see. So origin point here and then the insertion point on the sclera of the eye. We're now looking at this muscle that you're seeing here highlighted in green, and now we're looking from an anterior view of the eye. This is known as the medial rectus muscle. This video is not over yet. Continue watching now the full video at kenhub.com. We have lots more videos like this one available to our premium members on our website, not to mention all the fun quizzes, related articles, and atlas sections. So click on the button in the middle to watch the full-length video and master anatomy.